hard on that ball, but away they go through Lundqvist. Ramirez, Minotas, ooh, and almost an own goal, and it uh, was Zach McMath who had to fly across to prevent that. Now, if that had gone in, I wonder if they would have gone back to look at the Martinez. This is a, an important save for Zach McMath. Was it going on target? That same type of play that we saw in the open six Dynamo players, a five make it. Will it be Reyna? It will be Reyna straight at the wall. Appeals for handball. Give it! Penalty! Yarno is not happy, but we've got a good close up here. And oh, it's he, a handball. He's basically goalkeeped that and held it. I think you have to give it. Yes, it hits the wall. That's a long stare down for Inbaum, but he buries it. And the Whitecaps will play with the lead with 37 minutes left to go. And you know, Peter, you mentioned something there that is a fact. Uh, the, how long that took puts a lot of stress on the shooter. There's never any pressure on a keeper in those situations. You can only be the hero. His hands, and he's got his hands in front. It looks to hit both arms, but Inbom Wong puts that to the side and very calmly, under pressure, scores the game's first goal with a nicely taken side footer the opposite way of Joe Willis. Uh, you saw his body shape there again. He shows to that side and then scoops it back. Vera. Figueroa. He's going to try one from distance. And Knuckler. It's loose. It's trouble. It's in. Zach McMath spilled it. And in goes Mauro Minotas to bury the equalizer. It's goal number 13 on the season and in minute 78. It's a long way out though and the keeper must do better. If he can't hold it, it needs to be pushed aside. It is a difficult one to deal with where it bounces just in front. As it hits the turf there, I think that perhaps it goes right to McMath before it touches the ground. But it is knuckling and down, but it needs to be pushed aside right into the path there. Of the last man you want to see tap that into the goal, Minotis. And we're all level. Van Wall. Memo Rodriguez is there. Steps over it. Albert Deli smashes it and brushes the outside of the goal. It took a deflection, though, and it will be a dynamo corner. Player in the wall there at the end of the wall. Leads to the corner kick. Reyna. Back to Ali Adnan. Tried to play it through for Theo Bear. Couldn't spin on it. It does fall to Freddy Montana. You mentioned the tricks from Ali Adnan. Gets inside the area, a little step over there, drags the ball, and then with the right foot puts it into a dangerous area. Good touch there forward from Bear. And those are the types of goals we've seen over the years in MLS from Freddie Montero. And he puts it between the legs of Joe Willis to make it 2-1. Just switched from left to right foot so quickly. Boniak bravely puts his head down. He's in acres of room down that right hand. Free kick called against the Whitecaps at the edge of the box. Inbaum really got a piece of the Swede, but good ball in from Boniac Garcia, cleared away by Cornelius. And it's Zach McMath who has to recover quickly to bat that one away. There's a collision there. I don't necessarily think that it's Inbaum foul. That's going to do it. There's the final whistle. Robert Sabiga blasts the final whistle for the Whitecaps. Freddie Montero scoring a late goal.